Hello spinner, you're on Penstock channel about pen spinning. My name is Alex Lanz and today I will show you how to do a reversed tornado. Do you already know how to do a simple normal tornado? If not, you can learn it as well, I will leave a link in the description. You don't have to learn these tricks to learn reversed one, but to my mind it is easier to master. So I assume that you at least know how to do it. And you also know that it consists of multiple extended thumb rounds. Yes, not fake doubles, no basics bro. Stop confusing these tricks, you make them cry. Rewatch my video about difference between them and let the torch of learning burn mother. So, tornado is extended thumb round continuous. It means that tornado reverse is extended thumb round reverse continuous. And after mastering, when you see someone flexing with a normal tornado trick, like that guy in that anime, you'll be able to approach to him and say, Hey Lamo, is that how you hook up with chicks? <laughs> Look at me rewinding time back. Nah, we don't do things like that, we support each other, spinner's brotherhood. Ok, let's start with this monstrous name, extended TA reverse. It's not that monstrous trick, by the way, but I recommend you to already know how to do index back. Let pen turn over index closer to pen fingers bottom and try to catch in thumb flap closer to a cap, so bigger part will be from outer hand side. As you can see, I turn hand from up to down and catch pen in palm up. Now you probably think that I will recommend you to learn how to do fingerless thumb around reverse on this position, with a pause, as many other tricks and links I learned, but nah. -uh. Not this time. Though ok, you can practice this movement like this. But when I learned extended thumb around reverse, I looked at it as at a single motion from the start. I made index back, turned hand palm down, then and tried like hip mode closer to cap with thumb knuckle. It goes like this, you do index back, turn hand palm down and at the right moment sharply but gently at the same time turn hand palm side. At this moment you hit mode with thumb and make it turn over the finger. You see, just like with the normal extended thumb around, the secret lies in hand flipping up and down. By learning the motion this way you will be able to master it faster and smoother and the extended thumb around triggers requires both of these qualities. By learning you will sometimes curve hand in bizarre ways. That's ok, the most important thing is to keep one movement. Maybe sometimes you will start Start with the hand lower and uh, while doing a trick you will like raise it up. You can also look at it like at a fallen mode. It like rolls down and you help it spin by turning hand and placing thumb at right moment. Just let pen mode roll. But first, make sure that you confidently make index back landing pen closer to cap in thumb flap. Without that it will be harder to learn the whole motion. And after pen mode turns over thumb you catch it in 1-2 like this, with most of the weight on outer hand side. This will be a good starting position for the second trick in a row. But don't you hurry trying to link two reversed extended thumb rounds. At first it's be better to master at least one. When you can do it without those bizarre gestures, without raising hand, one, the only thing you do to in order to perform the trick is turning hand from up to down, that's the time to try to learn tornado reverse. After mod turns over thumb, you don't just catch it in one two. Instead, you make another index back without any pause. You don't even move fingers much, they stay in places, and all you do is turn in hand. Well, most likely fingers will slightly move, as probably you will need some support before each index back, but not much more than just a slight support. Just do not to rely on your anti-gravity skills for too much so far. Practice and they will come. And you will make pen dance in hand without any support. 